Fairphone is a modular smartphone. So that means that you can switch out new modules. It's built around sustainability and upgradability. And I'm really looking forward to getting into it. Just loving it, absolutely loving it. I really can't wait to unwrap this slab of chocolate, so let's do that. There you go, look, designed to open. There's a statement of intent. Looks to me to be relatively impact resistant. It's a kind of semi-translucent charcoal black. Oh, but wait, look at that. There's the translucent nature of the cover. Or oh, is that the phone? I don't know, is it there? That's the phone, oh my God, it's gorgeous. Let me show you what I mean. Take this off. Oh man, I love that. As many of you know, who follow my social channels, I'm a huge fan of translucent retro consoles. So anything like a, you know, a Nintendo uh, N64 that's, you know, translucent purple or a crystal Xbox first generation. You know, I love all that sort of stuff. And so to have a phone with that same material, that same aesthetic is really nice. And you can see all the components. There's the battery look, change is in your hands. It's all about reminding you that this isn't the finished product. It's here to evolve in your hands. Right, let's open it up, let's do it. Let's get it open. Yay. So cool, the, obviously the rear camera uh, on the Fairphone 3 Plus, that goes up to a, uh, I think 48 megapixels. So removing the battery, should I re require a new battery, is no more difficult than that. Okay, so this top module is the front facing camera and that's for the Fairphone 3 Plus module is 16 megapixels. I haven't even turned the thing on yet, but I just want to tinker. So this is a bit unorthodox. I'm gonna change these modules before I've even tried the camera because I just want to get it open. There we go, and that's it. And this gold connector here, that's, that's all that connects the screen. Isn't that amazing? So cool, so cool inside. Look, that's the screen in case it's not clear. So that's how you'd replace the screen. You'd get one from Fairphone and you'd just clip it into place if you cracked it or, or badly scratched it. And then you can see, look, they've labeled the various modules that are available for upgrade. There's the speaker module, look. So there's some screws, there's a screw there, I think. There's the bottom module, it's clearly the microphone. But I'm interested in upgrading uh, the top module, this one here, uh, and the camera module. So those two at the top, so let's have a look. So first of all, this is the ribbon cable that connects the uh, camera module. And I need to lift that up, I guess. Not quite, oh yeah, there you go. My nails are long enough. There we go, that's that. Yep. That's it. Let's get this camera module open. Take the covering off, whack it in there, the right position. Yep, there you go, heard it click, in, and now the next one. There's the spanking new front facing camera module. Another covering I'll just take off. Yeah, it's on, good. Okay, let's turn it on. The pulse, and it's alive. Wipe that finger in there. 
There we go. Nice responsive fingerprint startup. Let's try the camera. Okay, that's in selfie mode. A bit of video from the front facing camera. There we go. Guessing that's, uh, what's that, HD do we think? HD? Video quality, yeah, you go 1080p. Let's try the rear facing camera. Okay, first of all, do some video. Video size. Okay, good, so that, there you go. Look, we can go up to 4K uh, at 30 frames. That's really interesting. That's what I shoot at normally. Yeah, that's a decent speaker. It's not quite the premium uh, speaker experience that I'll, I get on my current smartphone, which is a Samsung, but it's perfectly usable. Try a bit of PUBG. Yeah, really responsive touchscreen. You know, games like this are an immediate indicator as to whether there's any issues with the screen uh, and its, uh, you know, ability to do the job, but it's uh, absolutely fine. I think he's dead. What can I say? I'm a big fan of the Fairphone. I love the ethos behind this phone, the notion of doing business in a fair and egalitarian way with their suppliers and sourcing materials in a responsible way. Uh, the fact that the phone is, is rugged enough to take a few knocks, but if you do break something, uh, there's a chance that you can replace it. Uh, the approach to modules, the supplying of a screwdriver is super cool, and I really enjoyed upgrading uh, the, uh, the top module and the camera module. Um, and the notion that I could do that if new technology comes out in the future is also a really novel idea. So yeah, it's, it's an absolute winner. Maplin, connecting brilliant ideas.